Hello viewers, I am sure most of you know what is blank ring. But well, for those who don't know what is blank ring, let me explain you that blank ring is glowing in a white or a pallid color for a chosen area and the contents of that chosen area will not be visible to the naked eyes. That is blank ring. So, though the content stays there, it appears to be blank. Well, why I am explaining you this is because the topic of this video, what I am going to cover here is to blanken cells. Friends, as a host of the YouTube channel, Sushil Shalot, I would like you to enjoy the video further on. So let's get on to the topic of the video that is blanken cells. If at all I have this area chosen in this region of the worksheet and if I want to blanken certain cells. So let me enter a value here say blank and say control enter if i do control enter the complete area has got entered as blank 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 and if you see this region of this portion has already been blanken and that's why you are not able to see the blank portion of this or the type or the spelling blank does not appear here well let's get on to some other area over here and let me give you a demo how i could do that so here I'm going to say, I'll go to the formula bar and type B L A N K blank. Once done, once done, I'm going to say control enter and the complete area, what was chosen, the region was chosen, has got converted into a array of the word blank. Now, if I happen to be choosing an area in this, and if I don't want this cells to be displaying the spelling blank how do i do there are two ways this may appear very simple and very silly as we are watching the video but well when you apply it in your applications it's really worthy when and how to blanken the cells is really a talented or a useful application in excel the first one is very simple i'll go over here to the font area and i'll convert the font of this area into white well white being the basic background color of the worksheet all the cells which are with the wine font text will be appearing as blank but if you go and click on any of these cells well you will see very much on your screen that the value is very much existing in this area well this is the first way of doing it what is another way well let me go over here and say Control z i brought the text back here and now the second method if you have watched my other videos many times i use this method i'll explain you how it is to be done over here so i've chosen the area and in this area i have two ways of doing the formatting i'll go over this area and say format cells in this format cell i can go to the custom tab and do the further activity or the other ways when the area is chosen i can go over to the keys control one and choose to select the custom tab and in this custom tab, I'll go over here from the area here and what is seen as general, I'll convert it to three semicolons. Once done semicolon, you can see the sample area here, which again is demonstrating as blank. So this is how the sample will look like. Well, let me go over here and say, okay, once done, immediately this area got converted into a blank region and if you go over here and watch you will be very much see, able to see that this area is having text within but well it's not visible to the naked eye well how and where is it applicable why do one require to blanken cells well if you have seen a few of my videos you must have noticed that i have used blankening over here in this video or in this excel sheet which i have used for making the video for the live calendar in excel if you go over in this area you'll see all this area or all these cells are having values within and those values are the name of the months as you can see as i am scrolling through and i have used that list over here for data validation for creating this list of drop down of the month names well here it is i have used the blank ring. Well, if you go over here in this area, also if you see, I have used the functions or a array or a string of function here: date value, weekday, 
and ampersand and all these have been blanked and so you are not able to see the content of the cells well here it is if i go here and i change the year here say 2017 and i say enter the month and the calendar gets appended accordingly as per the customization i will recommend you to go and have the view of the complete video here and you will enjoy it certainly so here i have used the blanketing very much you can see as i am scrolling through the tab or the cells you are able to see the values within well let us go to the video and i'll show you a short glimpse of where i use this blank blankening let me play a short clip for you our liking and our choice friends one can choose to hide these cells here from the screen by the same way what we did earlier control one or format cells and i'll go here to the custom and in this custom we have used the triple semicolon i'm going to use them and make this months vanish well friends this was a short clipping i recommend you go to the actual video and have a view or watch the complete video and understand how and where blanketing was essential and where i have applied in what way certainly with practice you will be able to judge where you require to do the blanketing and you will be able to apply it in your requirements please do practice it after watching this video i hope this video turns out to be worthy and useful for you please do express your likes at the youtube channel if you are new to the channel and if at all you have been watching the videos but you have not subscribed the channel please do subscribe the channel i will recommend you to do that so that you can accelerate your learnings and your quality capabilities and competencies along with the videos which i am publishing at the channel so friends stay safe i'll be soon back with my next video till then ciao choose goodbye namaskar